Ohio hockey has changed throughout the years, from its roster, to its coaches, to its staff. But what about the arena itself? Barely any changes have ever been made to Ohio University's Bird Arena since it was built in 1957. That was 59 years ago. While Bird is appreciated for its great history, it is in need of serious renovation. Several improvements and potentially a new arena are finally being talked about to take Ohio hockey to the next level. Uh, I think one of the main things that they're looking to do is fix the compressors. It's been around for like 20, 25 years and it's getting old to blow out and uh, it just affects the ice conditions and then uh, along with that the insulation on top of the roof. Uh, when we get here in the summer, up until probably about October, November, the ice is really subject to the weather conditions outside. This ancient compressor is what chills the ice, a crucial part to an ice arena. And it has been around since the 1950s. But that isn't the only issue. The arena needs a new HVAC system, upgrades to the building's roof, and far more seating for fans. Currently, the sides of the arena go up to just six rows at the top on both sides, leaving several people crammed, standing, or still waiting in line out the door before games. The team's locker room itself is also an issue. Uh, our locker room, kind of renovating it to uh, kind of the quality of the program's reach. You know, we're consistent to top 10 team every year and uh, you know, having better facilities will help us attract better athletes. These renovations would not only benefit Ohio hockey, but several of the other organizations at Bird Arena as well. The rink needs upgrades not only for the hockey program, but it needs upgrades for the youth hockey program and the figure skating and the learn to play. Um, so it's not just us that uses the rink. With Ohio Bobcats Sports Showcase, I'm Haley Hironowicz.